We must meet. Where will it be this time? Trash processing plant? Deserted end cart station? In the south of Japan town, there is a street market. It is on the footbridge above the main street. Use the elevators. It is easy to get lost. I am on my way there. Do not make me wait. Hey, Judy, what's up? Hey, can you come over, Stan? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up. But... Oh, perfect timing. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place. Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Gotta be honest, net running's not my forte. It is even less mine. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Let us move on. To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it.
fucking worked. And? It's done. System's ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Sid, I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. He's not on his A-game, sure. But even without implants, he could decommission us easily. Where's that come from? Ever seen him in action? No, just no. From the way he walks, look in his eye. We'll come back to this later. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things are even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you... stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agree. This we will do together. Cook! Louder! Louder! For the amount you already know of that. our active In night security forces. President Myers has called this a He eliminated the last obstacle form. between the himself and the complete the power. NUSA and they Russia. surrendered it to me. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions. Power struggles. All of this. Ksa. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept the sun on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Feels like that's about to change. Long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events. Conscience could also come into play. Assuming she's got one. 
We must reach her first. Will you join me? Get there on my own, thanks. Very well. I will soon leave as well. See you there. Officer suck to express her undying gratitude to you. Stop sir. talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Not sure we should move her before the badges get here. She's just another dead whore to them. Nobody will care. The least we could do is treat her with some dignity. Yeah, I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you! If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. <sighs> told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? You know... To you, she was your best friend, so it's a terrible tragedy. But they must get dozens of calls like this every day. What are you? Their fucking PR rep? No, just saying. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. <sighs> Bum a cig? Didn't know you smoked. Uh, quit. It's been years. But... Right now, I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Here. That was her smoke case. She smokes some strange boutique brand. So that's Evie. Whenever she pulled on a new face, it was down to the details. A lot of people know the real Evelyn. Who she really was? No. Nobody. Fuck, Evie. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. I don't know what to say. Never was any good at this stuff. 
Oh, you don't need to talk. You did more for her than anyone else. I had a motive to find her, Judy. You know that. It's what you bring that counts. You gave her the freedom to choose. Yeah, maybe. Just never imagined she'd choose this. Her condition couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Dull Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her. Had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. I saw him as your average tricksy sleazebag. He puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. I think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure, you don't need anything. No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. I have found a good place to observe. We must just climb up here. Now this way. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much. Hmm, perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. Footbridge, but it's guarded. We will use it to enter if there's no other way. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the way 
your houses. Antenna. Security hub is liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. This is not bad. I think I've seen everything. You wish to come for this reconnaissance, do you a job? I expected you to be more useful than this. All right, quit moaning. I'll give it another glance. Pipes, see him? We could use them to get inside. Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. Got eyes on the comm system. It's a lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Trucks drive up regularly. Are we to hijack one? Someone stepped in quicksand. Has serious trouble. A god? I cannot help with this. The procedures here I do not know. Well, I believe we have all we need. Let us analyze what we know already. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So. We going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in then. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a bacchanecho. A bacchanecho? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune, can restore the dead back to life. Feline ghost? Suppose anything's possible. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko too. Miss Home? A foolish question. I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once, when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. Childhood memories. Let's see. Hopping buildings, running away from badges, iron taste of blood from a split lip. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slab. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. Let me guess, so they could turn them into Corbo soldiers? Exactly. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. 
In the army, I was given everything I lacked before, discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. Did what you had to to keep from going hungry. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend, Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Wasn't judging you. And true, you opposed the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world in its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists, as if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability, safety? The cheap 11 slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that, too. We cannot fix everything at once. Tired of bickering. Let's just drop it. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world, forget everything. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompeki, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this, so we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Don't be smart. Got no idea what I feel. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or she'll make sure we die for good. The Bakanenko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we.